I am back with a quick spring clothing haul. I went to Forever 21 and also did some shopping at Target. I did some Target shopping both in store and also online because there were a few things I couldn't find in the store that they had online. First of all, the dress I'm wearing is from there. It's this beautiful coral maxi. This is a petite size. It's a petite medium. Okay, so I'm only 5'2 and most maxi dresses are just way too long on me. And this one is a perfect length and it even kind of drapes down longer in the back. Uh, the neckline is woven and it's kind of like a halter top. The one thing that sucks is that since I am nursing, my chest is extra large. So I do have to wear a bra. Either way, I would wear a bra. But the straps do show. Even though I'm wearing a halter bra, it's still exposed. I figured I'd like it so much that I did get another color. I got this green. Or is it a teal? I love the bright colors for spring and summer. The next thing I got was actually in the store and it was on clearance. It's just a boat neck. This looks like it's a three quarter length sleeve shirt. It's nothing really like out of the ordinary. This one cost, I think it was like eight bucks was on clearance for $8.40. I got another striped sweater. I do love stripes. I've been wearing it like all fall and winter. Uh, blue and white, it's also from Verona. This I thought would be really cute with white capris or white cargo pants, you know, nautical. I think it'd be so cute with like red lipstick and my hair up. And this was how much? I think this was on sale too, yeah. It was on clearance for $13.98. Okay, and then I bought this. It's actually like in the women's plus sizes. It's a cute maxi skirt and then it crosses in the front. This one says X, so I think it's like XL, extra large. It would be cute with just like a regular tank. And the price isn't bad. I did pay full price, it's 25 bucks. Oh, I also got this tank because we're gonna be going to Disneyland with the family and it's a fun, Disney characters tank top. They have a bunch of graphic tees, like in the juniors department, and this was only 13 bucks. So something to wear with shorts or rugged jeans. Cute, lightweight, perfect for Disneyland. Just got some jeans. This is like the boyfriend jean. And this was 25 bucks. Not bad for like good quality jeans. I think Target does a good job. Next, Forever 21. This would look really cute with those boyfriend jeans. And it says, tell me your secret and I'll tell you mine. I thought the red lips was really sexy and sassy. How much are you? $17.80 from Forever 21. Next is this dress. I don't know, I'm kind of like, I don't know if I'm gonna return this one. I did wear this in one of my videos. It's a beautiful floral and it shows like your back. It's really beautiful. The only thing is um, since I am larger busted, it makes like my whole front area look extra large, like extra, extra large because it's not really fitted. It just looks drapey all around here. Maybe this will look cuter when I've kind of sh shrunk back a little bit more. But as of right now, it's it's just not the most flattering on my figure. Again, as of now, it's probably not the most flattering to my figure, but I had to get it, even if I wear this like later on in the year. A loose fitting kimono shirt. I love the flowers, I love the color and the print on the sleeve. It's just so beautiful. I wish it had maybe a different type of neckline, a v-neck, or even if it just opened up in the middle like a kimono, I would have preferred that. Speaking of kimono, another kimono cardigan. And I mean, the color, isn't this so fun? And it's just so comfortable and flowy. It's the perfect thing to throw on when you want that pop of color. I love this kimono. I will have links below of all the items that I shared, or at least I'll try to find it. Quick announcement, if you are in the LA area, I will be there for Generation Beauty Saturday and Sunday, and I will be doing a meet and greet on Sunday. I have the information down below, so if you want to purchase tickets, it is pricey, it's $150, but I'm telling you, you will get your money's worth in makeup if you end up going for like the happy hour where you go around the booths and you get free makeup. It was insane last year. So anyway, that's it. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.